How today, <clears throat> at now as a successful actress what? and singer, right? So crazy. So how how do you relate to your weight today? Mm -hmm. So I've. I've seen many um, successful actresses who've come in and they're sort of a plus size or they're not skinny minis. Mm -hmm. And often you see they go and they lose all the weight. Like mm -hmm. Jennifer Hudson's one example, right? Mm -hmm. She's, when we met her on American Idol, she was like, she's a big girl. Yeah. <clears throat> now she's like super fit. It, do you feel pressure to um, at some point make that happen for yourself? Or do you feel more like, this is who I am, this is what I'm meant to do, and I'm meant to be, this is what I'm meant to look like, this sure. is my body, I'm comfortable in it. Yeah, you know, there's, there's no real, oh goodness, there's so many different levels of response, because um, I think as we evolve as human beings, or in our particular life, uh, we realize, oh, you know, this isn't serving me anymore, or mm -hmm. if we come, uh, God forbid, come across uh, uh, medical issues or, or problems that oh, maybe I just want to be a little more active. And some people knock the girls that like lose weight and say like, oh, why did you guys do that? You're Definitely. selling out. Yeah. And that's not necessarily true. Much like Kate, it's like, oh no, she's finally contending with the things that she was eating over, right? So I think it's more about the behavior around what you're doing. And it could be social media, gambling, sex, drinking, uh, food. It could be anything, fill in the blank. Um, how is my behavior around that? And how do I want to change that behavior? Because it's this thinking, thinking of like obsessing about something. And so for me, I'm like, am I eating for my health or is there something really going on? And whether I lose weight or I don't, I, I don't really hold on to like a number. You know, I don't think that's important, right? I don't think it's important because who's to say what, you know? people they're like wait what you got your blood work done and you have like great perfect cholesterol like it doesn't make sense I'm like I want you to know it's real like contrary to popular belief or like what we're told about what looks healthier what doesn't look healthy um I think it's hard too with weight because drugs and you know uh hardcore drugs or, or drinking or smoking is sort of glamorized and you're like oh she's sexy but if she's overweight um she's like sitting in the corner and like a lonely sad girl and you're like that's not actually true right and people don't know people's medical history so i think there's so many ways and i think it, it's important for every individual to determine what makes them happy and how to get to that like you know because we have to it's gonna it's gonna take some time you know there's there's ways that, um, you know, some days I'm like, oh, I'm definitely eating my feelings. And then some days I'm like, yeah, like when my heart is full, I'm not hungry. Right. So there, there's those kinds of thoughts that like, oh, what is the psychology behind it? So um, do I want to take care of my body and live a healthy life? Absolutely. Um, but that doesn't mean that you can't do it uh, at an unconventional size. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah.